Ah, just the person I was looking for. Your name came up in a discussion we had recently. My sister is very impressed with you so far, but I'm not. I don't think you have what it takes to work for this family. Luckily for you, I'm going to give you a chance to prove me wrong. What do you say? Want to make some real money? All right, then. If we're going to work together, there's only one thing you need to know about me. I like things simple. Recently, Glory negotiated a deal between us and a big-time player. We're talking more caps than you'd probably see in a lifetime. Your part in this is simple. To finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's some fancy shit, right? Don't know what her mother was thinking with a name like that. But this girl and I, we need to have a discussion. Find her, bring her here, so I can talk to her, one-on-one. -on -one. You don't want us chatting, trust me. As for the girl, I just want to talk to her. And if you can't bring her here, then you're no use to me, or Gloria. So if you want to cause trouble in here over nothing, then go on, try. I got business here. Need to watch the shop, make sure things are running smoothly. Besides, if I came for the girl, I'm not all friendly and charming like you are. She might get the wrong idea. Really? NCR all around her. Well, tell you what. You find a way to bring her here. She'll want to hear what I have to say. Find her, bring her back here so we can talk. Needless to say, there's some good money in it for you. You come around like a bad habit. What's on your mind? Jean-Baptiste. Sounds like someone got knocked out of the good book so hard his name broke. Either that, or it's Canadarian or some such shit. So who is this Baptiste, and what does he want? The only Van Graffs I know are the ones out west. Well, except for Gloria Van Graff, and I don't know her all that well. Nor do I want to. Don't have any objections speaking with him. Though if he's with the Van Graffs, he should know I'm not looking to buy weapons. Well, <sighs> that's the question I... Go with you? And why the hell would I do that? So you're looking for someone to help, not just tag along. Huh. Walking the Mojave with you can't be any worse than here, that's for sure. All right, I'm in. Again. As I live and breathe, Rose of Sharon Cassidy, the late Rose of Sharon Cassidy, was hoping you were on that caravan I massacred, but Crimson Caravan and Van Graffs won't need to worry about you anymore. Mojave's ours, and we're shutting you down for good. <laughs> really? We'll see about that. If you say you're going to gather evidence, then kill the bitches anyway, at least tell me when you change your mind. Now if you're done fucking around, let's settle accounts the old-fashioned way. Don't matter much how we settle this, as long as it gets settled. Just trim the Van Graff family tree. I think Freeside will breathe a little easier now. Now, on to settle accounts with Alice McLafferty. Putting her down? That would suit me just fine. Can't wait to see the look on her face when I show up. She'll know why. Music to my ears. Those cons get...
And that's it for the Crimson Caravan. Payback's a bitch, ladies. And between Gloria and Alice, that settles accounts as far as I'm concerned. Hope they're in hell right now, blinking, trying to figure out where they fucked up. <sighs> yeah, yeah I am. Never realized I had all that anger in me. Makes me wonder how much more I can settle with bullets. You know, when I first heard about them, I was so mad. But there was this little part of me that said, you can't do to them what they did to you. I say fuck that part. I feel purified. And I love the fact that there's no more loose ends. That's it. Except for one thing. Thanks. Not many people in my company would have done what you did for me without some hesitation or asking me to cool down. But you backed me. Even when the odds were against us. Words aren't enough. But thanks. Don't have to tell me twice. Feel more alive than I ever have.